What's up YouTube and my subscribers? I have hit over 650 subscribers today and I wanted to say thank you for subscribing to my channel and give me a thumbs up on the video uh, and interacting with my channel by leaving comments. I really do appreciate that. I know I haven't been too active on YouTube posting videos, but I am more free now. I have just been working on a blog version of this. So on the very top you're gonna see um, blog.shopdroidlife.com. It's a blog I've been working on for the last week and it's gonna have all the updates and all the tutorials on there so definitely check out YouTube and the blog and you also check out the Facebook page as well uh, you're gonna be getting updates on that too so stay tuned on that okay so let's get started on the Aeris wizard tutorial okay so I decided to make a new video tutorial on the Aeris wizard I know there's been some ongoing issues with um, installing the wizard and also the builds that are on the airs wizard so I decided to um, remake the video um, so we're actually gonna slowly get into what has changed and what's on the airs wizard um, as we browse through the builds you're gonna see the available builds um, I know there's gonna be some missing builds there's been some changes with that um, but these are the builds that you can download the are highlighted in green meaning that they can, that errors can actually check for build updates. Um, so pretty good amount here. Okay, so we're gonna look over, um, browse add-ons. You're gonna see video add-ons, program add-ons, repositories, uh, we'll click on video add-ons. So if you don't wanna install the build, you can install individual add-ons. Um, and they, there are pretty popular ones here, um, like Exodus, Phoenix, Sports Devil, um, the Eris stuff here, the old Genesis, Navi X, Three Migos, Ice Film. So definitely, definitely very cool. Um, going back to browse builds, you got program add-ons, repositories, Monkey Duck, NJM, Dexter TV. Okay, uh, maintenance. You're gonna be able to delete thumbnails, delete packages, delete your temp files. And actually do automatic maintenances and and reminders backing up you can back up your Cody data and restore it got some tweaks as we click more we got some other functions uh, system information Cody log speed tests and erasing your Cody and and make it a, a fresh a fresh version of Cody force closing Cody um, settings here and uh, yeah, that's pretty much the Airs Wizard. Definitely a very, very good all-in-one package wizard. Got your builds, your add-ons, maintenance, backing up your stuff, some tweaks, and some more little functions. All right, let's get started on installing the wizard. So make sure you have a fresh installation of Kodi. At the Kodi main screen, we're gonna go to System, and we're gonna click on File Manager. Then we're gonna click on Add Source. Then we're gonna click inside the box None. Now we're gonna type in HTTP colon forward slash forward slash airswizard.co.uk. Make sure the link is correct and go ahead and hit Done. Now in the box here, you wanna type in Aris or whatever you wanna name it to, doesn't matter, as long as you remember what it is. Uh, for now we're gonna use Aris. Double check the name, the link, click OK now you want to head back to the home screen okay this time I'm going to click on system and then I'm going to click on add-ons at this point I'm going to click on install from zip file I'm going to click on Eris okay and we're going to double click on this script Eris 0 0.045 Okay, and on the bottom right, you should see a, a rectangular box saying Aris Wizard add-on updated or installed. Okay, and once you do see that, go ahead and head back to the home screen. This time we're gonna click on programs. We're gonna click on Aris Wizard. Now a box should pop up looking for, checking for updates and it's gonna download a small file. That's about 1.82 megabytes. Okay, and we just wait a little bit. Now the wizard should open up pretty soon. 
Okay, there you got it. You have the Aeris Wizard installed. Um, definitely take your time to look over it. You'll be able to download builds, add-ons, uh, maintenance, backup, tweaks, just like we said earlier in the video. Thank you for watching the how to install the Aeris Wizard. If you found the video helpful, please give me a thumbs up and also please subscribe to the channel for future updates and visit the new blog at blog.shop droidlife.com and a like on facebook.com if you have time uh, anyways thank you for watching the video